Active folate or methyl tetrahydrofolate is the biologically active form of folate or folic acid and it plays a role in methylation. And methylation is very important in the body. Methylation is important to be able to make DNA or normal DNA so people who can't make active folate or have insufficient active folate may have a problem making active DNA and may have an increased risk for certain forms of cancer. Active folate or methylation is also really important to make neurotransmitters, especially monoamine neurotransmitters. So making enough serotonin and dopamine, and people who can't make enough of those neurotransmitters may have an increased risk for depression or anxiety or other neurotransmitter or mood-related disorders. It's also very important for detoxification in the human body, and it plays a role in homocysteine metabolism. So homocysteine is an amino acid metabolite of methionine that in high levels can damage the bones, the brain, and the blood vessels. So high homocysteine can increase osteoporosis risk, uh, it can increase dementia, the most common type Alzheimer's risk, and it may contribute to cardiovascular disease risk. So very important to metabolize homocysteine, active folate is one of the nutrients that's responsible for that. So uh, besides active folate, we also use methyl B synergy, and we call it methyl B synergy because they are nutrients that synergistically metabolize homocysteine, and that is uh, vitamin B12, and the B12 we use is methylcobalamin, the active form of B12 in the human body. We also use P5P, which is the active form of vitamin B6, and riboflavin, and uh, methyl tetrahydrofolate, the active form of folate. So those four nutrients make up what we call methyl B synergy, which is more of a comprehensive synergistic formula to help with homocysteine metabolism and methylation in the human body.